So introducing Slaughterhouse-Five to my class, my professor described it as, it's this weird combination because it's kind of science fiction because there's aliens, but then it's kind of a memoir because it's dealing with Vonnegut's experience as a POW in Dresden during this firebombing. And then he continued saying, now you've probably never have heard about this firebombing of Dresden, but it's this horrible allied attack during World War II that killed thousands of, hundreds of thousands of refugees in this city. And I had never heard of this. I needed to know more. And I had just done a study abroad and we had been to Germany and I could not imagine an entire town being decimated like this. And so I needed more information. Plus in the first chapter of Slaughterhouse-Five, Vonnegut is expressing the need for more information about this act that he survived. And so I started to research. And in my research, I found that there was articles published about Dresden bombing right after the event in 1943. And there was a wide, a wide variety of information that was very biased and very extreme. So not a lot of information there. And then in the 60s, there was whole books written about this event. And they were very inaccurate. The most famous being David Irving's book, The Destruction of Dresden, where he famously just added a couple zeros to the end of the victim count, making it seem larger than it actually was. And this concerned me so much. I, what was I supposed to do with this information? What was Vonnegut supposed to do in this information? This is the period he's writing in. And so I found that Vonnegut is creating truth for himself about this event he went through, through his book, through his story. There's aliens in this book. He is not concerned about historical fact. He's concerned about story. And this example from this in Slaughterhouse-Five is this character of Billy Pilgrim, Vonnegut's double. He is talking to this other character of Rumford, who's a very historical fact. He is quoting David Irving's book. He's quoting these inaccurate facts. And he is basically the historical guy. And to this, all Billy Pilgrim says is, I want you to know I was there. We don't ever have to talk about it, but I want you to know I was there. And for me, this was Billy Pilgrim, this was Vonnegut saying, don't look at the history, put that aside, listen to me, listen to my story, listen to my truth, because I have truth that I can give from this experience. And for me, the truth is that empathy is needed, dignity is needed when you go through these acts of horror and horn and bad things, you just need to learn empathy. And I saw that Vonnegut was almost saying, you can learn these historical truths, but it's more important what you learn from them and what the stories, what you learn from their stories as well. Thank you.